Hello everyone and welcome to Tech Upskill channel. In this video, I'll show you how to fix the issue where your screen flickers when plugging in or unplug the charger on Windows 11. And now let's get started. The first step is adjusting the refresh rate in the display settings can help resolve the issue. Open settings, go to system, and select display. Scroll down and click on advanced display settings. Under the refresh rate section, choose a different value from the drop-down menu. Changing the re refresh rate often fixes the issue, so try a different setting and check if the problem is resolved. The second step to try is switching to a different power plan. Press the Windows button and select the Settings icon. In the Settings window, click on System from the left pane. On the right side, select Power and Battery. Under Power Mode, choose either Best Performance or Best Power Efficiency from the drop-down menu. Once you've made the selection, restart your computer and check if the issue is resolved. The third step is resetting the power settings to default might help. Press the Windows button, type command, and run command prompt as an administrator. Once the command prompt window opens, copy and paste the command provided in the description. Press enter to execute the command. After completing this step, restart your computer and check if the issue persists. The fourth step is adjusting Windows HDR settings, which can also help resolve the issue. Press the Windows button and select the settings icon. In the Settings window, go to System on the left pane, then click on Display on the right side. Next, select the HDR category. Under Related Settings, click on Video Playback. In the Battery Options section, open the drop-down menu and select Optimize for Video Quality. If Optimize for Battery Life is selected, Windows might disable HDR when running on battery power, causing a sudden refresh rate change. This could make the screen turn off when plugging in the charger. After making these changes, check if the issue is resolved. The fifth step is to update the driver, right-click the Windows button and select Device Manager. In the Device Manager window, expand Display Adapters, then right-click on the problematic device and select Update Driver. Click Search Automatically for Drivers and Windows will attempt to find and install the latest available driver. If updating the driver doesn't help, try reinstalling it. Right-click on the problematic device and select Uninstall Device. Check the box next to Attempt to remove the driver for this device, then click Uninstall. Restart your computer, and Windows will attempt to reinstall the driver automatically. Once the driver is reinstalled, check if the problem still persists. Before ending this video, I'd like to mention that I create high-quality, tech-related videos every day. If you enjoy my content and want to support my work, please stay tuned. I hope you found the video helpful. Um, if you have any questions, drop them in the comments below. As always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.